Hello guys, recently on this channel I had a video about switching roles between for example patient and doctor and in that video I asked you in the comments to suggest a solution to avoid extra database query. So as it stands we need to show the current role of the user and also get all the roles to be able to switch to one of them like doctor. So we have three queries in the database on every page the current user data, current user role because it's eager loaded, and then all the roles of user. And then in the comments, one of the comments gave this idea. So Jeremy suggested to load that query only when that menu item is actually clicked or hovered over, that's your personal preference. Basically, the third query to list all the roles is needed only when someone clicks there. And this is a great example. This will be a live wire example, but you can use Vue.js, whatever. The point is to maybe minimize the query if some query is present on all the pages, but is needed only in the section of the page that is rarely actually clicked. It's a candidate to minimize the query and to hide it only on click event or something like that. So how does it work? I've asked my colleague Modestas to implement that and this is what we came up with. So before, before any live wire, we have something like this. If we have more than one row, then for each of the user rows, which is actually what fires that database query. Instead, we can move that drop down link with that for each into a live wire component, which is exactly what is done here. Instead of all of that, we have live wire role switcher we called it that role switcher is a live wire component which is very simple actually just renders the view and also has loaded true or false and a listener that listener is powered by in the same navigation in the button button of username at the very end we have this on click window live wire emit the event that event in itself triggers loading of the roles and then in the blade file of Livewire, we have the same thing. Depending on loaded or not, we show loading or the list of roles. So it's almost copy paste, maybe even identical to what used to be in the blade. So now if we remove that and leave only Livewire component here, here's how it works. Let's refresh the page. And now we have only two queries in the debug bar. The third query of listing the roles comes up only when I click. So for half of a second loading and then it loads the roles and then that query appears here. So this is a good demonstration of an idea. Maybe that's not the best example, but as a concept, hiding the queries under some kind of view or live wire component, which would load the data only when it needs to load that. In this video, I've intentionally skipped the installation and configuration of Livewire itself because I think you should be familiar with that. But if you are not in my courses, if you search for Livewire, I have at least a few courses. So practical courses like creating a quiz system or order management system, but also advanced Laravel Livewire and probably the main one for beginners, practical Laravel Livewire from scratch. It was created in October 2020, but still fully relevant because Livewire didn't change since then, but it will change in 2023 because Livewire version 3 will be released on July 20th. So I'm planning to reshoot this course a bit later in 2023. But still, I will put a link to that course in the description below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.